A report reveals the top choices for apartment living in Dubai, so drum roll, please. Now, if you're looking for an apartment... <laughs> so- She's just not interested like this morning in anything I'm saying. Now, if you're looking for an apartment... I was so into... The re- I said we should leave our jobs right now. Will you actually like partner up with me and start this? Do you have the seed money? I thought you would because you like lending money. So. <laughs> Perfect partner. I'm the brains. You're the finance. <laughs> okay. We're going to hit some roadblocks. <laughs> You can't be so negative going into it. I don't have any money. <laughs> Then how would you lend to your friends if you don't have any money? We're just going so off topic. Here. Okay. <laughs> going back to apartments. Now, if you have the money and you're looking to live in Dubai uh, and you're looking for an apartment in Dubai, we're about to list the spots that you'll have some, uh, you know, very stiff competition. Because Property Finder's latest annual Market Watch report 2022 reveals key real estate trends for Dubai and Abu Dhabi and the lowdown on rising prices. It states Dubai's property market has picked up this year as Emirates' uh, economy continues to make a strong recovery. And that being said... That being said, the average rent prices for apartments rose by around 25% in 2022 in comparison to 2021, and villas' uh, rent increased by 26%. Now, as you could probably guess, uh, this is due to the increase in the expatriate population, so more people coming into the country, i.e. rising prices, uh, prices, more demand, and also increase in the construction costs, pricier to build, pricier to live in, um, and also in addition to the interest rate, which as we know uh, has risen. Um, So the bad news, it's expected to increase more in future according to Property Finders report. Um, Now they've listed the top five places. These are the top five searched places for apartment living and then also for uh, villa living. Uh, So number five, Business Bay. Uh, number four, downtown. Number three, Dubai Marina. Number two, JVC is the second most searched for apartment living in Dubai. Finally, number one, you might have guessed it. Palm Jumeirah. Your wow. number one choice for wanting to live in Dubai. Of course. Of course. The place is stunning, iconic, an island, just path breaking. Path breaking. And it's also just. It's Palm breaking. <laughs> 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 it's also just had such a level up, yeah. right? I think it's just had such a massive uh, rejuvenation um, in the last, I guess, may, it feels like in the last couple of years, it's got yeah. Nikhil Mall, um, it has, you know, incredible, um, it's got the Royal Atlantis is opened, exactly, yeah. um, Club Vista Mara, mm-hmm. Palm Beach West, yeah. uh, amazing new properties, amazing new hotels have opened. I'm trying to think of the name of the, not the Metro, the The tram situation. The tram. What is Was it? The tram. The Why metro link. The what's it called? The metro link. Monorail. Monorail. The Genius. monorail is amazing. Yes, monorail. Um, we're we're forgetting loads of places, but Nikhil have done just a fantastic job of making it such. a incredible destination to live and they have like super uh, pricey accommodation but they yeah. also have kind of more affordable but also still quite pricey <laughs> but but they have you know like you know more affordable for who for people with a lot of money but they have you know these really um spectacular types of accommodation that like millionaires from all over the world are buying up and that's why the prices are going up but uh, it's become like one of the most uh, in-demand places in the world to live so no surprises for sure like when you go property hunting you want to start your search from there just so you know what to um, you know like It's like the most uh, like top tier, right? Like, I don't know. I would want to start searching. So because uh, when friends of mine came down, like they asked me for suggestions for like places to, uh, you know, residences in Dubai. So I suggested like a few places and they're like, no, a little high and a little high. And so I'm like, okay, Palm Jumeirah. And they did not settle in Palm Jumeirah, but they went there to look for homes. And the views from Palm Jumeirah, it's like, it's better than the movies mm. and on a day when it's raining and cloudy it's just or sunny a, or sunny like anything <laughs> however what we've learned from this report is if you're if you are somewhere already and you already have a rent just keep it yeah. because what's going to happen is it is getting more expensive as they said and the top places for villas are Pamish Mara's number five. Oh, of course it's on that list Dubai Hills estate number four and then in three two one Arabian Ranches three Arabian Ranches 2 and then Arabian Ranches. 
and those prices have risen 26% in the last year in comparison to 2021 as well. Mm-hmm. Um, so take note, they're probably going to rise again. So, and as you know, if you are a tenant, the laws are in your favor and uh, rents cannot rise more than established by RERA. So if your landlord does try and raise 26%, they actually can't do that. So do know your rights. Exactly. And what you said is so true, like uh, before the point that you made on like as the cost of development increases, so does the cost of rent. And now people just want such luxurious amenities and like a pool and a jacuzzi and this and that and all these facilities. And then they and then it's like then they see the price. Yeah, they see the price. They're like, oh, never mind, you know, so it's like it, it goes hand in hand. But of course, like we know that the rents uh, that the pr- uh, prices of rents are increasing. So big tip. Stay where you are, stay put. Stay put. And also, I think just shop around in terms of location because obviously, Palm Jumeirah, number one, Dubai Marina, you know, these are sought after locations, but you can get a lot for your money in other locations. Like apartments in uh, in Dubai, they may not necessarily be the most modern, but they're very spacious in comparison to other cities. And we're looking at the price comparisons between, for example, a villa on the Palm, which is... astronomical yeah but you you know there's there's three or four bed villas which actually are in specific areas are more affordable so if you maybe if you drive and you're willing to kind of go a little bit further mm-hmm. out add to your commute you can do well for your money just maybe the most sought after areas are a bit tricky 100 like you have al nada you have al gases you have karama you have dera you have all these areas that uh, are very affordable in terms of like uh, living and for families uh, so You know, like, of course, expand your search, like Casey said, Shop to these around. areas. Yeah. And then you can see what meets your budget. And of course, like, if you, like Casey said, have a car, it just makes things much easier. Um, so it's Friday. We are super excited for the weekend. As always, we're back with you on Monday morning. Uh, same time, same place. We're actually going to be joined by Winnie Fue, who is a cancer survivor. And she's going to share her journey with us on the show on Monday morning. So stay tuned. Have a brilliant weekend. Goodbye from me. Goodbye from me.